Hey there, YouTubers. So we're having a little discussion on IndianaAngler.com about free bait, and one of the things we're talking about is catalpa worms. And I used to pick those with my grandpa when I was a kid. He would take them down to the White River and catch channel cats with them. And I happen to have a catalpa tree in the backyard here. So I'm going to show you what they are. They usually come out about uh, mid-July, late July. It's July 24th right now and they are hitting the trees pretty good. There's one. The trees aren't as loaded as they used to be with them, but I mean there's still quite a few on there. There's just three right there. And there's a huge one right there. So I'm going to pick a few of these and we'll go down the pond and try them out. That's one thing I never liked about these little boogers. They will spit on you, shit on you, whatever it takes to get away. And all they do is eat them green leaves and whew, they will stain your fingers huh? <laughs> I guess bass like them too and it saved my bait Easy little fella. He's feisty. <laughs> I guess I'll use that one again. Hello. I guess the big bluegill like them too. Oh man, that's a nice one. Jeez. That thick little thing fought twice as hard as that bass did. Yeah, I would say catalpa worms still work. And that's still that same one. I might just go put the other two back on the tree so they'll keep reproducing. So anyhow, if you know where a tree is with big funky lime green leaves, go check it out. It might be a catalpa tree. Hmm. And you might get some free bait. Uh, <laughs> 